to the lab there and the deputy mayor, distinguished guests. I'd like to welcome you all here this evening to the Jack of Patsy offering. This evening, we're going to officially launch, I suppose, two years of work that we've done over the last two years. Uh, it's great to see Patricia here. Patricia will be now tutor for the last two years, a very able woman. And it's great to see all the students here as well. Looking around the walls, you'll see pictures and paintings and drawings, sketches, critiques, bits and pieces of everything. And when you look at it, it's hard to believe that two years ago, most of the students involved here were not involved in our work. One or two had been doing it as a hobby, but for the most part, everybody got involved. And this is the, I suppose, the end work. There's different things I want to say, but before I do any of that, I suppose, I'm going to hand you over briefly to Marcella Reardon. She's a, a local artist here in York, and she's going to officially open the exhibition. So please put your hands together, please, for Marcella. Absolute flowers, 
the All Pharmacy, Cash from the Bookmakers and the Old Imperial Hotel. They sponsored some of the prizes which we'll be giving out later on, uh, I suppose in a raffle, and I'll talk about that briefly in a moment. But to those people, we'd like to say a big thank you. On behalf of the students who've been involved in the course of the last two years, we would like to just say a big, huge thank you to Patricia. Could you give your hand and give a big round of applause? I, I said it on the radio last week, and uh, I mentioned to Patricia, Patricia a while ago, she's the smallest but most dogged woman I've ever encountered. And when she says, when she suggests that she wants something done one way, that's the way it's going to be. But she's a fantastic artist and a fantastic tutor. Thanks a million for everything. To, to all the staff of Open the School, to Patrick and Ann, Patricia Walters, and everybody else involved, and the other teachers as well, we have to express huge, huge thanks. It's not easy going back into education. We're all used to getting our own way as we get older in life. I myself am the most cantankerous fella I know, hard to work with and hard to work for. But uh, going back into education, I woke in a couple of things within me. And I didn't think I'd last two years, but Patricia made some sense into me around the afternoon on several occasions, and it worked. And, and, we, and there's a good bond between all the students, and, and we just probably enjoyed the two years. It was an education, but it was an education worth getting. It was fantastic. And I'm delighted to be able to say that some of the students who have, continued, or who have done that course will be continuing on to take their course levels forward, which is a great sign of the students. So they deserve their own applause as well. Thank you. There's a couple of other people I want to thank as well, and I want to mention one thing. We, we have, uh, as I said, we've got lots of raffle prizes donated, uh, or prizes and items donated. So what we decided we do is we hold a raffle, but we're not going around selling tickets. What we're asking is that you make a donation and you get some tickets in return. Uh, with that, uh, you, it, it, it's below where the, the wine is and stuff like that. I can't go down there, there's too much drink. But that's where the, the tickets will be. So if you're passing by, you can get a couple of tickets for a donation and we'll be calling up the results of the, the raffle later on. Um, it's for, the funds of that are for Sister uh, Riley, who's doing um, unerring and unending work out in Pakistan and every few bob help on that. We'd also like to thank uh, Noel Connor from the VEC for, for everything, for all the good work he's done, for having such a fantastic VEC centre in Mial, where we don't have to travel to Dungarvan or Middleton where we, in our own hometown, can get the education we want from young and older life, and it's a great premises, and all your staff are very good. You should be applauded and thank you once again. I'm going to shut up now, because the more I talk, the more I'm going to get myself into trouble. Enjoy the artwork, and thanks very much, Marcel, for opening it, and thank you all for coming to see me. Thank you.